in first step just plug in the USB cable so you can plug it here and now it's connected to PC now next I will show you in the PC you need to download the driver from where you can download for programming the meter first we need to install the driver for the USB so right click on my computer and go to manage now here go to device manager and you you see here USB serial port com port 3 so since uh, the driver is installed already so that's why it's showing com port 3 and everything looks fine in case if it's uh, not okay it will show yellow sign like this one so in case if it's yellow sign that means we need to install the driver so just go to google and type ft232 usb driver and whatever windows you have like windows 10 windows 7 whatever and the link is uh, ftdichip.com uh, i will put this link in the description so you'll just click and you'll go directly to the page now once you go to the page uh, you need to search which one is suitable if your pc is 32 bit you have to download for the 32 bit in case the pc is 64 bit you need to download for 64 bit since my pc is 64 bit so i downloaded the 64 bit driver now the driver is on the desktop which i clicked right now and just go to that uh, usb serial port and click properties and go to drivers and go to update driver now select the second option browse my computer for driver software and click on browse and find the location now the location was on desktop which i selected the folder and i'll cl click next and you see here it's showing that it's installed so that means all good right now so i'll close these windows and we have to remember that this is com port 3 now i'll go to uh, mark software mark configuration utility software i'll open it and here click the plus sign now communication type is serial and the uh, com port is com port 3 and this is the baud rate 576600 uh, this is by default from the factory and i'll click next now first drop down menu you will select right and then you will select multifunction meter and in the device model find the model our meters model is 1360 so i will select 1360 and put the id it's one in our case and now on the right side this panel is for uh, writing the setting for the uh, for our meter so we can read and write so once i write the value it will show successful dialog and if i read it it's showing the same value which i entered so that means our communication is good and the device is following so in this list you can program the ct primary the pt primary secondary and even you can program the logs which you require here is the list for the logs